Hi everyone, welcome back to Garden on the Moors. This weekend we've been in Cyprus. Um, here are a few clips from our trip, some of the highlights. Enjoy! After some sightseeing around Paphos, we headed northwest to explore the Aphrodite nature trail and soak in the spring wildlife. As soon as we set off, we noticed these big bobbing flowers that I initially thought were poppies, but it turns out that they are actually turban buttercups. They come in a range of colours like lime green and this gorgeous golden yellow colour. As we climbed up the mountainside, we saw lots of wild cyclamen growing in the shade of the trees, even some in them. They are a speciality of the area and one of my favourite plants to grow in the garden. Continuing our route upwards, one of the first birds we found in that tree up ahead was this mast shrike, which are truly awesome birds. Like other shrikes, they are songbirds with a taste for flesh and impale lizards, insects and other small animals on thorns to eat them. These guys better watch out. So all around this trail we've seen loads of wildflowers that you'd see um, in like a cottage garden and one of them are these gladiolus. So we've got this beautiful little pink flower here one of the wild gladioli and there's been absolutely hundreds of them really tiny dainty little thing but just as gorgeous That's a chakar partridge. It's the Eastern European, Eastern Mediterranean, I suppose, red leg partridge. And it sounds a lot like Vera when she's a bit teasy. So we've just found this really cool orchid. I think, we have to check when we get home, but I think this is a tongue orchid, um, which is a species that has started to. Um, come into the UK. I think it's on like a rooftop in Essex or somewhere like that, but surrounded by all these other lovely flowers. You've got like um, grasses, um, little trefoil things, and there's so many flowers in this place um, and birds and all sorts. But this has probably been the best flower we found. The following day we went to the Pickney Forest which was full of trees like pines and casuarinas. There were loads of birds enjoying pine cones and shade including these great spotted cuckoos. They don't make the usual cuckoo call but they do still lay their eggs in other birds nests. In Cyprus these are typically hooded crows and magpies. Walking down the path, we heard a turtle dove calling in the distance. It was pretty hard to find and photograph, but its parent call did help us to find it. Just to prove that shrikes are songbirds, here's one singing.
I've actually seen lots of strikes before, but this is the first one I've ever heard actually singing. We came across this beautiful green valley filled with fruit trees and in the scrub you can just about hear a nightingale singing. These are carob trees and their bean-like fruit is used to make a traditional dessert on the island called halva. The hillside here has been terraced and it looks like they were using it to produce hay for the small goat farm at the top of the valley. There was even a hoopoo on that far side and some bee eaters migrating overhead. Well, we've had a brilliant time uh, these past few days in Cyprus, and this is possibly our, one of our last finds. It's this absolutely gorgeous, I think this is a spider orchid, um, and behind it we've got some what look like chives as well, just about to flower, or you know, some sort of relative of them. But we've had an absolutely brilliant time, and this is a lovely way to end our trip, just by enjoying this last little flower. There we are, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe for more. And we'll see you again next time. Cheers.